For anyone that has been keeping up with the Starfield modding scene, you'll know that Star Wars mods are by far the most popular and most requested mods to be implemented into Starfield pretty much at any given moment. In the future, you will be able to overhaul your entire Starfield experience to basically turn it into a Star Wars Bethesda RPG. And with that, of course, there needs to be Star Wars companions to tag along your adventures as you mod Starfield to your wildest Star Wars fantasies. And some brand new Star Wars companions are exactly what we're looking at today. But before we begin, if you love Star Wars, if you love Starfield, and you love Starfield modding, please leave a like on this video, subscribe, and leave a comment down below what Starfield mods you want to see showcased next. Now, let's get right into it. The brand new work in progress Star Wars companion mod that's available on both Xbox and PC that we are looking at today is HK47 Vasco Skin by Radiclown. This mod adds not one, but two HK droid outfits from the Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic video game series, as well as a unique blaster for Vasco to use. The outfits cannot be worn by the player, and the blaster can also not be equipped by the player. These new items are specifically intended for Vasco and possibly any other Model A robot followers to use in Starfield. To get started, these outfits can be crafted at any industrial workbench in the game. At any industrial workbench, you will be able to craft the actual HK-47 replica skin to replace Vasco's look with, or the base Bounty Hunter HK Assassin Droid skin that is also seen in Knights of the Old Republic 2. The new outfits for Vasco add no additional bonuses and the blaster shares the same stats as Vasco built in the face laser, essentially making this entire mod completely cosmetic. Now, at the beginning of this video, I did say this mod was a work in progress. Yes, the models for both the gun and both HK Assassin Droid skins look absolutely incredible. They look like they've been pulled out of a modern, high-definition version of Knights of the Old Republic. However, the Vasco replacement skin still uses Vasco's robot skeleton, which means that HK will still kind of walk like a chicken, kind of how Vasco does in Starfield. One day, the author does intend on returning to this mod to fix the animations or replace them in some sort of way, but that's not all I'm hoping the mod author returns to do in this mod as well. Another companion and follower mod that I covered recently on my channel has to do with the character Legion from Mass Effect. That mod not only changed the entire look of Vasco to change it to look exactly like Legion from the video game Mass Effect, but changed the voice as well. Vasco's voice lines have been changed to have the sound of Legion's voice play Vasco's lines in the game, making it that much more immersive and making it feel like that Legion is actually there in the game. Conversational protocols engaged. If I could add one thing on my wish list for this mod, it wouldn't even be the animations. I can live with that just a little bit. Having HK-47's iconic voice implemented into this mod similar to the way that it was with Legion would be absolutely perfect, and I think that would be such an incredible addition to the HK-47 follower mod in Starfield. But I want to know what you guys think. What other Star Wars followers are you hoping to see in the future be implemented in the Starfield? And what do you think of this one? If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and comment down below what Star Wars mods you want to see implemented in the Starfield next. Thank you guys.